Sepulu Nopemba Institute of Technology Indonesian, Institute Technologi Sepulu Nopemba, abbreviated as ITS is an Indonesian public technological university located in Surabaya, East Java, with a strong emphasis on scientific, engineering, and vocational education system. ITS has five faculties containing 27 academic departments which occupy an area of 180 hectares. ITS was founded on November 10, 1957, as its establishment charter was signed by Sukarno, the first President of Republic of Indonesia. Initially, Sepulu Nopemba Technical College had only two departments, civil engineering and mechanical engineering. In his speech, President Sukarno himself gave the strong emphasis on the spirit of Sepulu Nopemba, remembering the famous Battle of Surabaya which reached its heat on November 10, 1945 and annually being commemorated as Heroes Day in Indonesia. In 2001, in response to the vision of Abdurrahman Wahid, the fourth President of Republic of Indonesia, its introduced an Faculty of Information Technology consisting of two departments, Informatics Engineering and Information Systems. Today, ITS's educational disciplines have expanded beyond sciences and engineering into fields such as arts and business management. ITS is known as one of the best engineering schools in Indonesia among ITB, UGM and UI. In addition, other two polytechnics, Electronic State Polytechnic (PENS) and Shipbuilding State Polytechnic (PPNS) operate independently on the same area at ITS's main campus in Sukolilo, an area in the vicinity of Eastern Surabaya. History <inaudible> <inaudible> Early years In 1957, ITS only had two departments, civil engineering and mechanical engineering. Three years later, ITS expanded by opening electronic engineering, naval architecture and shipbuilding engineering and chemical engineering departments. These departments then changed their status into faculties. In 1965, ITS opened two more faculties, Architectural Engineering and the Faculty of Natural Sciences. In 1965, ITS had seven faculties, Faculty of Civil Engineering, Faculty of Mechanical Engineering, Faculty of Chemical Engineering, Faculty of Electrical Engineering, Faculty of Naval Architecture and Shipbuilding Engineering, and Faculty of Natural Science. In 1972, the campus of the Faculty of Civil Engineering was moved into JL. Manyar 8 Surabaya, the ITS campuses was separated. In the late of 1975, the Faculty of Architectural Engineering and Faculty of Natural Science were moved into JL. Kokroaminoto 12A, Surabaya. Today, ITS has three campus areas, Kokroaminoto, Manyar, and Sukolilo. The Sukolilo campus is the biggest area. The development of the campus area geared up in 1977, two decades since the conversation between Dr. Anka Nitazastro and I.R. Soed Jasmono that defined the fighting spirit of its character to become Indonesia's best university. <laughs> development In 1977, with financial aid from ADB, it started to build a campus complex in the Sukolilo district in eastern Surabaya. Since then, all departments and faculties have moved to the new campus. In the early 1980s, reorganization took place in ITS, and the former faculties were downgraded into departments and merged into common discipline faculties. Hence the new ITS organization comprises four faculties, the Faculty of Mathematics and Natural Sciences, Faculty of Industrial Technology, Faculty of Civil Engineering and Planning, and the Faculty of Marine Technology. In 1988, ITS opened its first polytechnic branch, Shipbuilding Polytechnic of Surabaya. This was followed by the second, Electronic Engineering Polytechnic of Surabaya, in 2001, at the suggestion of the fourth Indonesian president, Abdurrahman Wahid, a Faculty of Information Technology was created. It consists of a Department of Computer Science and the newly created Department of Information Systems. 
On December 14, 2010, President Dr. Susilo Bambang Yudhoyono officially signed the establishment of the Robotics Center Building Gedung Pusat Robotica in its campus, Sukolilo, Surabaya City, in 2013, its, as an institute of technology founded by a medical doctor by the name of Dr. Anka Nitazastro, had its first doctoral graduate on medical engineering, Ingrid Nertanio, lecturer at University of Hassanuddin. Topic: Research and achievements. From the Widya Wahana project, Indonesia's first solar-powered ship, to the Jalapati project, Indonesia's first solar-powered car, ITS is well known as a pioneer of cutting-edge research in Indonesia. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Naval architecture. In 2012, it's participated in the Atlantic Challenge at Bantry, Ireland, and won the Spirit of Atlantic Challenge. It's launched Indonesia's first solar powered ship, and took part in a world competition, Dong Energy Challenge, in 2014 in the Netherlands. <laughs> <laughs> Robotic engineering 2012, a team of students was given the Toyota Award at the Abu Asia Pacific Robot Contest Abu Robocon in Hong Kong. 2014, a team of students was given the second runner-up and best engineering award at the Abu Asia Pacific Robot Contest Abu Robocon in Pune, India. 2016, a team of students Ichiro was given 10 medals at 21st Fira Huro Cup in Beijing, China. 2016, a team of students Barunastra was given the second runner up and best speed and maneuverability at 9th Annual International Rabarboat Competition, a UVSI foundation in Virginia, USA 2017, a team of students Ichiro was given 14 medals at 22nd Fira Huro Cup in Koziang, Taiwan. <laughs> Concept car Decades ago, it's launched Indonesia's first solar-powered car, Widya Wahana. It was tested in Australia, in a world solar car competition. 2012, the urban energy efficient concept car, Sapu Angan, won the Asia Pacific Energy Saving Car Competition, Shell Eco Marathon Asia 2012, at Sepang, Malaysia. 2013, its Sapu Angan Speed won the Best Rookie Award of ICV at Student Formula Japan. Additionally, it's won the Shell Helix Tribology Award off track award at Shell Eco Marathon Asia 2013. In the same year, Spectronic VI from its one first place among presentation posters and third place in competition at the Chemi Car Competition in Chemeka 2013 in Brisbane, Australia. 2014, it's launched the biggest electric bus in Indonesia, funded by PT Telkomsel. 2015, it's won the Shell Eco Marathon Asia 2015, in Manila, the Philippines, in the urban concept diesel category. Topic research Research and Society Service Center LPPM Environmental Center Energy Center Earth and Disaster Mitigation Center Marine Center Industrial Center IT and Multimedia Communication Center Continuing Education Unit Intellectual Property Rights Unit REMA ITS Research Institute for Web and Mobile Application ITS Laboratory for Housing and Human Settlements Robotic Research Center Faculties and departments There are ten faculties, some departments offer diploma programs. In early 2016 the Department of Industrial Engineering achieved a better accreditation. In early 2015 the Department of Informatics, Department of Statistics and Department of Environmental Engineering also achieved a UN accreditation. Topic: Campuses. Its has three campuses in Surabaya. Its major campus is located at Sukolilo, where all undergraduate programs are located, along with the postgraduate buildings, administrative building, main library, faculties housing, student community center, football stadium, jogging track, and student dormitory that can accommodate 1,200 freshmen. A smaller campus is located in Manyar district, providing a civil engineering diploma course. 
The third campus is located at Kokoro Street, providing a postgraduate technology management magister course. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Student activities. ITS is well known for its winning spirit in sport. In 2015, Seaborg ITS's team won first place at College Bowl 2015, the largest football league held by Indonesian Flag Football Association Maritime Challenge ITS's team won first place at Atlantic Challenge International 2014 in the Ore and Sail category, in France. ITS has a variety of student organizations involved in politic, religion, sports, the arts, and other activities. These include Student Executive Organization Student Legislative Manual Ilmi Masjid Members Er Siklis Its, Students Environmental Organization Its Students Choir Its Foreign Language Society IFLS, Its Radio Pramuka Its Tiang Alat Theater Dr. Anka Students Cooperative Workshop of Entrepreneurship and Technology -E &T Its Maritime Challenge Lodrok Its Traditional East Java Play, converted to a more modern and contemporary style. Topic. Academic facilities and campus life Overall, the campus is spread over a land area of 187 hectares. Graduations are conducted at a general functional hall with a capacity of 4,000 occupants. Sport facilities can be found on the campus, a stadium and football ground, futsal courts, basketball courts, tennis courts, wall climbing, gymnasium and indoor badminton courts, rafting canal and jogging tracks. Notable alumni Gomblo, singer and composer of the legendary Kebya Kebya, which was ranked at the second place on the list of Indonesia's Best 150 Songs of All Time", by Rolling Stone Indonesia magazine, born in Jombang at July 14, 1948 and died in Surabaya at January 9, 1988. Hermawan Kartajaya, who was named by the United Kingdom's Chartered Institute of Marketing on the list of, "...50 Gurus Who Have Shaped the Future of Marketing in 2003." Muhammad Nuh, Director of Electrical Engineering Polytechnic Negri Surabaya Pens 1997, Rector of Sepalu Nopemba Institute of Technology 2003-2007, Minister of Communication and Information of Indonesia 2007-2009, Minister of Education and Culture of Indonesia 2009-2014, graduated from Department of Electrical Engineering. Agus Rahajo, head of the Corruption Eradication Commission (KPK) since the 21st of December 2015, graduated from the Department of Civil Engineering. Triras Maharini, mayor of the city of Surabaya, named in the Top 50 Greatest World Leaders list in 2015 by American business magazine Fortune, graduated from the Department of Architecture. DWI Soechipto, president of Pertamina, the largest Indonesian oil company, since 28 November 2014, graduated from the Department of Chemical Engineering. Muhammad Arif Wibowo, CEO of Garuda Indonesia Airlines, the largest Indonesian airline, graduated from the Department of Mechanical Engineering. <laughs>